<laughs> what am I doing? Hey, before I go to Los Angeles, I got to test the sucker out. I bought it months ago, haven't used it. Welcome back to my vlog, you guys. I appreciate you being here. Uh, kind of a casual day, but I wanted to get one more vlog in before we actually went to Los Angeles to see the ZR1 American debut. Yes, this channel, in case you've never been here before, is primarily about Corvettes, a little bit about me. We like to do those instructional videos, those how-tos. We love, I love sharing your customer stories. And of course, we talk about the ever-changing Corvette marketplace. And we've got a few little things to talk about today, some retail stuff that, again, I, I want to bring a stronger point to that today on the vlog. And also, too, I'm going to ask you guys to comment. Do you have any questions? If I get an opportunity to talk to some of the General Motors executives, do you have any questions that you want me to ask them? Welcome to today's vlog. Oh, yes, and I've forgotten. If you've never been here before, please hit the subscribe button. I'd love for you to come back. Hit the bell notification. That way you know when we do new uploads, like when we're at Los Angeles. <laughs> Well, guys, you know I'm excited to go to Los Angeles, and I appreciate your support. A lot of cool comments. Looks like you're excited that I'm going, too. So it's going to be a quick run. I mean, I'm flying in late Tuesday, all day Wednesday, going to be at the show, uh, grabbing all the pictures, uh, all the video that we possibly can to share with you. And again, that's going to be a different venue. Uh, I would love to actually be there when the show opens to the public and hang out with you guys, the fans, the Corvette owners, the Corvette enthusiasts. Yeah, right there at the display. I would love to do that with you guys. Don't get me wrong. Uh, my schedule doesn't permit to do that, but what we're going to be showing you is going to be the stuff before it opens to the public. And I think that's kind of cool. That's kind of a different angle, and I hope that you enjoy that. So we'll be at the media days, hoping to have an opportunity to talk to, as I mentioned earlier, to some of the General Motors executives and show you a little bit different fanfare, be able to climb up on the stage, get into the car, and yeah, that's going to be pretty cool too. And then I fly back on Thursday. That's an all-day travel day. But the goal is, is I, you know, I've got, I use so much at work that I don't have a working laptop. And this one's got this going on. This one needs a battery. So I'm using my son's old laptop, hoping, got my fingers crossed. It's like, please, baby, I just want to do one vlog from Los Angeles. Yeah, my goal is Wednesday night after spending all day at the convention center is to be at the hotel to upload a vlog and share a little bit of what we have, which we anticipate that to be a two-part vlog. So Stay tuned for that. Uh, again, if you hit that bell notification, you'll know as soon as we do an upload. So that is, that's the goal is to do one for you Wednesday night before I get back. Because let's face it, when I get back on Thursday, you think I want to sit here for four or five hours and edit? Oh, no, no, no. I mean, I don't mind it, but I just don't want to do that after traveling all day and being away from the kids for three days. So uh, we're going to do what we can to stay in the forefront for you guys and stay on top of this, though. Uh, that I promise you. And coming up before I go here on this vlog, I am going to make this vlog a little bit about a retail stuff. Again, I want to break down and show you in numbers. Yeah, we're selling below invoice. We're selling below GM supplier. Yeah, we're selling below GM employee. But what does that mean? Show me in numbers, Rick, what that actually means. You're going to see that we really are making an incredible effort to do business right now, to give you a reason to do business right now. And I thank you again for those opportunities. So that's coming up in just a sec. Yes, I love holding the microphone. I'm, I'm like a little kid right now. <laughs> I'm having a blast, um, but I'm sitting down. I got a couple small pieces of viewer mail that I want to share with you. Appreciate that. Oh, and here's the other thing while I'm in Los Angeles, and if I'm fortunate enough to get an opportunity to talk with, you know, guys from Team Corvette like Taj or Harlan Charles or whomever else may be there from Chevrolet about the ZR1, I have a few questions myself, but if you guys have a couple of questions, I'll try to ask the guys those questions that you have, and I know that everybody has a lot of questions. Of course, first and foremost, what's the price? What's the price? Prices, prices, going up, woo! Prices, prices. Sorry, I was... I like that. I don't even know where I got that song. I like that song. What's the price? Prices. You guys will be singing that one when you brush your teeth tomorrow. Trust me. I think the whole point of this little ditty was is if you guys have a question for the guys at Team Corvette and I have an opportunity to talk to them, let me know what those questions are in the comment below and I'll do what I can for you. You know, it's pretty cool, too. Going to the L.A. Auto Show reminds me of the time that in 2009 when the ZR1 was released and actually revealed for the first time in Detroit. Here it is, ZR1 2009. This is the little press kit that they had. It's kind of hard to open, but you go through it. And it's got all kinds of neat pictures and data. 
specs in there, pictures, all kinds of cool stuff, and of course a little CD with all that data on there, but what a nice keepsake to have. This is something that was never sold to the public, it was only given out to the media at that Media Days event. Now, do I think that they'll be doing something like this in Los Angeles? Well, it's not really a reveal, so I don't know in fact that they'll have a media kit. You know what, I don't get a chance to do this segment too often, and when I do, it's a great honor, and I appreciate it so much. It is time for some viewer mail. You guys are watching, you send me mail, it's viewer mail. Thank you. <laughs> oh yeah, all right, so, do we start with the little ones? For the bit, now? Nah. Heck no, we're going for the big one. <sighs> this comes from a hat in Tennessee. <laughs> Uh, so send you a little something from Tennessee. Sent me a little. <laughs> Sent me a little moonshine. Ricky you don't drink, but I appreciate the moonshine. Could you imagine if I drank? Oh my gosh. I got a little moonshine. Homemade moonshine. Here you go. <laughs> Look at this. Peach. A little apple moonshine for you guys. I don't know what this is. Just say C H A R. What you, I don't know what that is. I, I'm not a moonshine person. I don't know what it is. <laughs> okay, what's that? Okay, yeah, I'm gonna want to drink that. I have no clue what that is. I'm not drinking any of it, but hat. God bless you, brother. Thanks for a little taste from Tennessee. I'm sure it's fantastic. Uh, I'm, again, I'm just not a drinker, but uh, this is pretty cool. This is the time to do this and bottle of stuff and send it from Tennessee. That, that's pretty neat, man. Thanks. All right, and this one comes from an avid watcher, obviously. Thank you. Uh, from Gary in Westlake, Ohio, otherwise known on the channel. It's G Money. <laughs> G, thanks, man. Oh, that's kind of cool. Uh, Rick, this is the uh, opening night giveaway. One's for you, one's for Ryan. It's the magnetic schedule for the Cleveland Cavaliers. That's pretty cool. Oh, yeah, look at that. Oh, Ryan's going to love that, man. Thanks. I appreciate that, Gary. All right, we've got one more, and I appreciate this. I mean, this is really cool. It's touching to me that you guys do this, so this is cool. Uh, D. Anthony in Virginia sent us a little something. Oh, dude. Dude, you're... <laughs> I guess it was only a matter of time as much as I whined about it on, on the vlog. I'll show you what he sent me in a second. So fitting for vlogging, okay? Hey, Rick, my name is D. Anthony. I'm a Cleveland native writing you from D.C. area. I'm a retired Marine. God bless you, brother. Thanks for your service, man. Over 20 years, and I appreciate your love and admiration for our service members. Absolutely. It's uh, deserved, no doubt about it. I'm also a YouTuber who started a channel back in July of 2017. It's a channel about my love of cars, especially Corvettes, and photography. I've included my business card for the particulars on my channel. Now here's the cool part. Check this out. He says, Rick, I also included a pair of Blender's Shades. He goes, I know that you like to keep it personable with the viewers and probably not wear them. However, these are kind of special as they contain the Grand Sport Heritage Stripes on the sides. Just my way of saying thank you for all you do for the vets and the Corvette community. My pleasure, man. D. Anthony, thank you so much. Hey, check this out. If you guys go to, uh, what is his website? BlendersEyewear.com. Use this coupon right here. You'll get 20% off. Here's his business card. You guys can pause that and check out his information. Here's his YouTube channel. Oh, the glasses. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm going to wear them. Oh, yeah. Check this out. Oh, you've got like a little cleaning thing, too. Hang on. This is kind of neat. Got the little logo on there. Nice and soft. Oh, yeah. And here's the glasses. All right. Hang on a second. I don't want to break them. Yeah, there they are. Look at that. Look at that. Grand Sport Heritage Marks on the sides. Blenders. These are cool, man. These are really, really cool. Take this off there so I can see you guys. Oh yeah, I'm wearing these, man. Yeah, remember, BlendersEyewear.com, D-A-N-T-20 for 20% off these cool vlogging. Ooh. Hey, dude, dude, these look good, man. Ah! <laughs> I love them, love it, love it. Check it, check it, check it. Yep, there you go, Grand Sport Heritage. Oh, time for a little dab. <laughs> D. Anthony, that was, that was awesome, man. Thank you so much. I really, really, really appreciate that. And here's another, uh, I think, oh no, this is not a clean rag. This is an actual case to, to carry the glasses in. Wow, check this, this is like a little case to carry the glasses in. 
Dude, that's nice. Uh, you gotta be rocking it. This is really cool. This is all nicely done. The coupon, all that kind of stuff. Nice, I hope we get some sales off this because uh, these actually feel pretty good. I'm really not a glasses guy. I mean, only when I gotta read something because I'm blind as a damn bat. But, uh, these, these feel great. I mean, when you put them on and they just hug your face, they fit perfectly, you know, and they're not too big for your face. These are cool. These are cool, man. Thank you so much. I think I'll wear these the rest of the vlog. Thanks, DeAnthony. Hey, and don't forget, guys, we have given away a ton of prizes. It's my way of saying thank you for joining us on the channel. Another way of just kind of spreading that Corvette cheer, if you will. Uh, here's a running list of some of the people that have won of a recent vlog, several vlogs, lots of cool prizes. I need some information from you, and I'll get on this as soon as I get back from Los Angeles and start getting these things sent out to you guys. Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate the support, and congratulations to all of our winners. You know, in the past, I broke down that, you know, you buy a car, it's a sticker, and then the price levels as they decrease and discounts go to invoice supplier, the G employee being the best that you can get if you're lucky enough to even work for the factory and have one of those numbers. But right now it's so significant because General Motors is doing the GM employee for everyone. And I've been telling you that our extra flexibility, what we're trying to do to give you reasons to buy now and save now is we're selling below the General Motors employee pricing. So let's put some numbers to this so you have some kind of an idea, all right? Let me give you an example of four models real quick if I may, all right? So thanks for watching. So right now I got a 1LT coupe. Okay, the MSRP on that car is 58 945 okay so i'm not going to go through the invoice supplier and all that kind of stuff right now the bottom price the general motors price on that car is 52.884 and the coglin price of that car right now is 49.884 and if you have the chevy loyalty and this will be the price you see advertised because most of the people that we deal with do have 99 or newer chevys and you've got to put the best marketing effort forward to get that phone to ring and all that kind of, you know what I mean. So we're trying to sell the car, yeah. So that price then becomes 46,884 on a 1LT coupe. And this is a car with black wheels, performance exhaust. <laughs> what a great looking car. What a great value right now. Okay, here's another one. Now this one's bizarre. This is a 3LT Z51 car, all right? It's white, has the dual racing stripes all the way down, beautiful Kalahari interior, automatic, lots of extras on this car. It's stickers at 76.5, all right? <laughs> General Motors employee price on this car is 68.369. Our crazy price on this car, 61.540. Now cost is way above this price, but that's the General Motors employee price for everybody for Pete's sakes, 61,540, but wait a minute, <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> if you have the Chevy loyalty, it's another $3,000 off, making it 58,540 for a car that stickers at 76,5 right now during the 2017 closeouts. Do you see why I get excited? Do you see why my voice goes three octaves up? I mean, this is nuts. It's so nuts, and if I don't get excited, if I don't get crazy, if I don't get goofy, you guys aren't gonna get it. And when you do get it, you go, hey, well, I was watching this video from a couple of months ago, and that's a great deal. But guess what, it's over. So yeah, this is right now. That's a 3LT Z51, all kinds of examples. Okay, two more examples. Check this out. Here's a Z06, it's a 2LZ Z07 car, all right? Stickers at 103,775. Now the General Motors employee price for everyone on that particular car is 92,621. That's the GM price. Okay, that's a great deal. Congratulations. One, I mean, wonder from 103 to 92, wonderful savings. Our price on that car is 90,746. And if you have the Chevy loyalty and the price you'll see on the website, it's going to be 87,746 for a Z06 that stickers at $103,000. Now when I say we're giving up everything and then some we are, folks, we really are. Uh, we, let's face it, we're trying to sell a bunch of cars, we're trying to jet some inventory and you're trying to save some money. So we get it, so that's why it is what it is. And the ease of doing business uh, is a great value, no doubt about it. And this is off one of our special inventory purchases, another Z06, it stickers for $100,000. $605, all right? And the General Motors employee price for everyone on that car is $89,852. That's a great deal. I mean, four months ago, 
we weren't talking about these type of prices. Now, our price on this particular car is $83,605. What? Are you freaking kidding me? This, this is the GM price. Mind you, our cost is higher than that. But when we do special purchases, if we get some extra flexibility, we pass it on to you so we can do business right now. All right? You don't have to think, think about what? All right, 83605. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. And if you have the Chevy loyalty, it's another $3,000 off, 80605 making that a $20,000 savings. Folks, these numbers just aren't normal. They're truly unusual. They're truly unusual. These truly are special times. Hey, don't forget to check the pinned post. See if you're a winner in some of the last blogs. Gave away a lot of stuff. Got a lot more stuff to give away. Just another way, again, I want to say thank you for supporting the blog and supporting Corvette. It is fantastic. It is like it's just a little family here. You guys are pretty cool. Oh, yeah. I'll be looking at your comments and your questions that you may have for the General Motors Corvette team in Los Angeles. Stay tuned. I'm going to do all I can to upload late on Wednesday. I'm so sorry that we're not going to be able to be there together. I'm still going to do Detroit. I'm going to do Detroit in the media days, and I'm going to go back in the public days, and I want to meet up with a lot of you folks. So as we get closer to that in January, we'll talk about that. And I've got another little surprise I'm trying to plan in January. So stay tuned for the details on that. But thanks for joining us. Make sure you thumbs up this video. Subscribe to the channel, as I've asked many, many times. And I'm sorry that I pound that. I'm uh, trying to make this sucker grow. I can't do it without you guys. So thank you again. And if you are going to stop dreaming and you are going to start driving, I want to be your guy. I want to earn your business and I want to be a part of your Corvette family. And we send it out with a big message to Chevrolet. What's the price? What's the price? What's the price? Prices, prices, going up, woo. Prices, prices, the big bad outside. Prices, prices, going up, hold on.